All right, it's it's up. The broadcaster said this is for mature audiences only. I wonder why. Yeah, I, I have to click that setting considering the subject of the game. Oh, I thought you were be I thought it was because of me. Well, okay. well, that too. I would prefer if it was just because of me. It just makes me feel better. Like, I wish they had... Y you know how Ezerb has the different levels? You know, because as far as this stuff goes, it's like... Really? Like, T for teen? Fair enough. Fair enough. Is the quality better? I, I upped it a little. I can actually read that just a, a little bit. Okay. Twin candle bent to the will of central saint, casting their light on the contours of the chapel. Father Jaumaya thought it would be trusted, thought I could be trusted with the secret. But he is like all the others. So the old priest has gone into the holding pens with his flock. He says he'll enter into our world with them. A shepherd indeed. Creepy. I gave myself a headache with that. With what? Maybe it's because I said that all with one breath, I don't know. I mean, it's probably a good idea to breathe. Eh, just because you said that I won't anymore. <laughs> no need to be snippy. I refuse to breathe! Nice. Or again. Oh, I really like this music. I love it. I like this organ. Minus that scream. Yes. <laughs> Did you ever watch, uh, what was it? Was it Mozart? Mozart or Beethoven, I can't remember which one. They, they did this kind of parody of a movie about him, but, well, uh, the prince said, "Oh, it's it's beautiful music, but there's uh, there's too many notes." Your faith, Jack. What is that supposed to mean? It is an iron coffin that keeps you from grasping the future. We require a new deity, one of steam and the wheel of magnetism and progress. The old god is nothing more than a lamed hog. Spitting back awful at mankind. Why do all of your analogies have to re uh, go to pigs?
he deals with what he knows. Now, I have an, an idea for a little bit of a game we could play. Let's figure out why he's fascinated with pigs. What is your theory? Uh... I'm taking this seriously. I'm not taking this into the realm of sexuality. Do not worry. I I know. I'm I. I don't know. Maybe there's biological similarities. Well, that's no fun. Where's the? Gr I recognize this room. Yes. It's the end of the custom story. Well, Kevin, get a little more creative with it. Creative? Yeah. For example, my theory is he was the son of a farmer. When he was younger, he, there is an issue where he may have gotten thrown into a pig pen or gotten or fell into a pig pen, broke a leg or something, and he wasn't able to get out, and the pigs were just crawling all over him and everything, and it, who knows? You, you realize you just gave the beginning of Batman Begins? <laughs> just with pigs? <laughs> what? Wait, what? <laughs> what? That's that's what happens in the in the beginning of Batman Begins. They don't he, fall he, into a pig. He drop. falls into a well, and bats are all over the place, and he freaks out. Hmm. You, you just gave me the origin of Pigman. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay then. Let's see. Um... Uh, is there a way that you could, uh, increase your volume on your microphone or something? You're a little quiet. Is this better? A little, yeah. This is called manually tug adjust. <laughs> Here's another one. Oh, do you want me to read this? Yeah. Okay. They flock to us now, where once I had to walk amongst them to bring salvation into their lives. Now, drawn by the warmth in winter, by the food that Mandus, Mandus distributes, my church is full of my charges are saved. Oh yeah, that definitely is, that's what that pig on the cross says. He walks amongst them, and they almost worship him. He will allow them to work in his factories. He will not allow claiming his, oh, will not allow him to work in his factories, claiming that his workforce are especially trained for the new machinery he uses, and that it would be irresponsible. Nay. Does that say unethical? Yeah. Okay. Unethical to risk such precious lives as he sees here. A man. A ch <laughs> A changed man since Mexico. It is to be praised that in the face of such appalling tragedy and from the confines of his sickbed and his trough, as he is often chained to. <laughs> I, I didn't even read ahead and that just works. <laughs> He conducts one of the greatest and most benevolent charities in all of London. Not content with the rise to become a do the dominant food produce business in the land. He distributes his goodwill, his fares to the poor, and they congregate about his kingdom in gratitude. Okay, I shouldn't have read that creepy. I need to read who's writing this at the top. Father yeah, Jeremiah. that was the pastor, yeah. I think. Yeah, I wrote that wrong. I feel like... Like I need to be looking for a... K 
candlestick that's missing from that altar. Oh. I think uh, one of the more terrifying things about Amnesia is that it gives you the running that you normally have in Nightmares, where you feel like you're running just a little bit too slow. Oh. You know what I mean? Every time I see I have a nightmare and I end up running, I end up running as if it was a cartoon, or if it like a really, really bad green screen. If you know what I'm talking about. Nice. Why is that even here? Also, is the other room locked? Yeah. Okay. Oh, great. I'm trapped. Hi, trapped. I'm Hobo. Oh recognize this place? Wait a minute. Listen, Papa. Hold the I made from the mod. See. You forgot to open the chest. I don't think there's anything in it. Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. Well, the only reason I said check the chest is because, well... That's what you usually do. In the original Amnesia, at least. No, stay inside. You hear that? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Egg. So that's probably the vicar. In that box? Yeah. That is a sound that should not be down here.
No, no, it shouldn't. Oh dear. There's faces on that smokestack. Oh god, there are. There's also a skeleton next to the boiler in there. I see a man going down the stairs. I don't see a skeleton. A man going down the stairs is a skeleton. Great, I need more gasoline. My computer really doesn't like rendering this. <laughs> this company meat processing factory rose Is it wrong that I want one of those trucks? How would it be wrong? They're because neat. They probably don't work. The thing is, like, I, I understand why people collect cars and they want original stuff, and that's all well and good. But in the same way that you would take, like, an old firearm and refurbish it, like, Seriously, right. put a new engine in that. <laughs> okay, in that thing, there's not very many engines you can put in there besides a wankle. If you put an extremely fuel-efficient 
uh, riding Maybe lawnmower more. engine in there, <laughs> I'm pretty sure it would be okay. That won't have enough horsepower. I don't know, there's a lot of really good ones. The only thing I know is that there's a new car being released in Michigan that I want. It's called the Devil 16. It has five over 5,000 horsepower in, in it. Why do you need 5,000 horsepower? You already know my answer, Kevin. I'm not going to say it because you hate it. Why not is not a reason. Yes. Yes, it is. No, it's not. If people watch this in the future these men and say, these and they could probably agree or disagree with me, why not wheel, is a good answer. And turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who why not these is just a license to do anything you want. <laughs> yeah. That's why it's a great answer. No, it's a terrible answer. Because there's a lot of reasons why not to do a whole bunch of things. Like, it's too expensive. You'll never use all of those horses. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. Oh, that's a bad idea. If you try to pull down heaven, you'll only raise up hell. And deliver them to paradise now. It's happened every time it's tried. Like communism. I wonder what it is specifically about the pigs that causes flickering lights. Some kind of... I have a feeling it's the mechanical components inside them. Maybe Tesla or something that's emitting some kind of an EMP or just electromagnetic field. Does that make sense? Phone. And Beware the riches who populate this compound. The way you seek is under the pistons. When you meet the saboteur, you will understand everything. He really hates that phone. <laughs> well, yeah. I hate it too. Colin, do you know my number one complaint with horror? You don't play it enough? No. My number one complaint about horror is that it doesn't make any sense. Why? 
Because in every horror movie, it is nothing but the worst case scenario. And that does not happen. And for some strange reason, every time whatever is being... Uh, whatever is terror, terror, terrorizing people is never shot. <laughs> it's like, even, even in Jurassic Park, they have a shotgun for, like, two or three scenes, and it, the shotgun never works. Like, it never goes off, or the shotgun pellets don't go through? Like... No, no, it goes off. Like, you, you hear them shooting the shotgun, and then you see the shotgun on the ground, jammed, and it's just like, I'm sorry, dude. It's a pump-action shotgun. You can clear that jam in a second. <laughs> but still, the shotgun itself, I can probably say they were using birdshot, maybe? No, that was buckshot. It still may not go through dino hide. But you would... No, you would see... <laughs> it's not so much different than an alligator. You, they kill alligators with 22s. At point blank. It's a 22. I'm pretty At sure a 12... A, a 12 gauge pellet has the same... Uh, has the same power as a 9mm. With the ranges that they were shooting at them... I'm pretty sure you'd see at least one dead raptor. Maybe. I'll give maybe to you. And if you go with the ancient bird idea, they're even more, uh, vulnerable. If this looks a little bit choppy to you, it's also a little bit choppy to me. Choppy, choppy, chop, chop, chop. I don't know why, but I feel like you're in a, you're looking at the cockpit of a Zeppelin behind you. Place is a tad in intricate. So, number six isn't on. Number three isn't on. Oh, these are sliding doors. <laughs> Strange. That is a large clump of coal. Did I do that wrong? Actually... Oh, that one's on. Grab some extra coal. I only saw one out there.
Number two is off. Where's number two? Over there. Oh, there's already coal in this one. Anything in the chat? It wasn't ominous enough in here. Will you stop doing that? Okay, I have no idea where I'm going, and there's a pig down here.
Guru. Compound X storage. Oh, that's Vitae, isn't it? Danger, no naked flames. Great. Uh, let's see. Oh, another note. The crate arrived this morning, and I had it delivered directly to the workshop. The body is remarkably preserved, although there is a subtle, yet nauseating stench of damp and rot. It is humanoid in shape, but has suffered severe skeletal deformity. Remnants of leather straps encase the torso, which is deformed with evidence of substantial muscle mass and Sorry. displacement. It is difficult to ascertain whether this unfortunate is the res recipient of some barbarous sur surgery or was born deformed and an attempt to force his gnarled body into some semblance of humanity has made uh, was made. What he is, I cannot tell, but I smell the orb upon him, and suspect my great-uncle's presence in his curious condition. So it can be done. We can reshape the body into a tool, accelerate the process of Mr. Darwin's evolution, but here my great-uncle and I part company. He chose men as the subjects of his experiments, but men are difficult to control, and rotten with sentimentality. No. We require a new creature for our chattels. Loyal, clever, strong, and easily sated. So he got a grunt from the old castle. My brain is hurting right now. From what? Multiple cabin. Multiple what? Multiple Kevin. Oh, are you hearing it twice? <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then he's Oh, by the way, you know the car? But uh the five thousand horsepower car? What about it? Uh, 350 miles an hour. Well, that's impressive if you ever needed to go over 80. Okay, so... <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing because I, I someone just sent me a picture where somebody combined a Volkswagen Beetle uh -huh. with a, a Bugatti. A Bugatti. Hold on, give me a moment. It shut down. No, no, I. See. Can't, can't we say no? A big loud capital N-O? I, I, I can't look at that, dude. <laughs> I know. You will be able to eventually. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me see if I can... I can look at it on my phone. Wow, that is... I actually kind of like it. Uh, I, 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 I wish, I wish the back rounded out properly, but, because it, that just makes it look like a, like a hatchback or something. 
<laughs> oh my god, somebody made it originally as a meme, and then uh, Bugatti built it. With the Volkswagen's approval. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Seriously? Yeah. There's only one, but it's worth it. Oh my gosh. Wait. What? I just got an. I just found an image of the steering wheel of the Devil 16. That's the last thing I'll send you. Eat because we're still streaming, but this is confusing. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they're trying to be futuristic. I just think it's simplified. <sighs> Why is it that the, the future has to be ugly? Why is that? <laughs> Everything's white and smooth. Okay, the Devil 16 isn't w smooth, well, white. The interior is. Of course. Never get in an elevator. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> it's okay, it's just some massive internal bleeding. Uh, again with the phone. Quickly, Mantis, find the entrance nearby. The children weep in the darkness, and the flood waters continue to rise. Well, at least this place isn't causing a lag spike. Here's that lamp. There's also a fly. In order to fuel. In order to facilitate assimilation of tissue groups, a compound is required or the cells will not bond. Disposal of non-bonded subjects must be immediate and using incineration or we risk continuous animation without form. This is unpleasant. A simple compound of one part Brennenberg infusion vitae. Oh, yep. Yeah, there's the, there's the vitae. I think he calls it compound X. To one part organ monad dispersal fluid. I'm not sure what that is. This can then be administered intravenously to subjects following reassembly to maintain bonding. The compound is unstable and highly light reactive. Ah, that's why we need the light. Once in the body, the Schumann lamp can be used to activate the compound, but outside the body, it is highly corrosive. It can even destroy small quantities of metal. Well, that's convenient that I needed to boil away this lock. Alright, so I need some kind of acid. Mm. 
No. 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 Ah, oh, centrifuge. Low temperature storage. Holding pens. Can I can I close this, please? <laughs> Oh! That actually startled me. <laughs> okay, it was a phantom? Inflamed it is, burning it does, bleeding from each hole for an at you. Why'd you stop reading? I don't want to say this out loud. <laughs> You're gross. Yikes. Um, didn't I come in here? Did the room change? I came in here from that direction. Oh, no. Running, running. It fell onto his hands and they eroded in front of me. To stumps, to stumps. Next time we will use an equal mix of infusion vitae and orgone disperser. No, no, just take him out. You could dump him in the river for all I care. Well, that's not very nice. Teeth. Yeah. OK. 
Okay, so... Now what? Anything in here? I really don't want to go this way. Great. Do 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 I've got to get through this place quietly. It's those little sounds you hear in the distance in this game that yeah. make me uncomfortable that I love. I love that. <laughs> it's not the things in front of my face that scare the shit out of me most of the time. <laughs> What I don't get is that this guy was rich. You've got two sons. You're rich. You've got all the resources in the world. You can send them anywhere. 
Oh, but they'll die in the trenches. Well, not if you... Over there, place it in the corner. What? You think I speak Prussian? Do I look like an inbred hog, sir? Who gives a damn what it contains? Just set it down carefully and leave me be. He could have sent his kids to any country that was neutral. supposed to be going. Let's see. Go back to your patrol. Where'd he go? Come on. The lift has been sabotaged. You will have to find another way to the tunnels. Take care in this place, Mandus. It is the crucible of the evil that stalks these corridors. Okay. Facility access, pig line, opiate dispension, gag throttle, bilge pumps, disposal tubes, engine rooms, boiler, organ towers. Okay. Something in here.
I keep talking. I've muted myself so you didn't have to hear me bumping all the time. And I feel like a doofus. What were you saying? <laughs> I was just saying stupid little snarky comments. Like, uh, Kevin, it's a lever! Oh. And, like, stuff like that. And why the hell did I just hear children laughing? And there's a teddy bear under the, the pipes behind you. More experiments with compound X. Took the dog and injected it with strychnine. Yikes. Do you want me to read this? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. More experiments with compound X. Took the dog and injected it with strychnine. After the expected convulsions spasming, it died after midnight. I missed the body in a large tank of compound X and introduced an alternating current via induction coil. Oh, that's four. A period of three and a half minutes. Partial return was induced. However, damage incurred prior to death was retained upon revival, meaning the dog continued in the acute state of strychnine poisoning until they put a bullet in its skull. But drowning? Perhaps, yes. It is, after all, known to be the kindest of suicides. If for one were to drown, replacing the fluid in the lungs with compound X should theoretically be perfectly possible as a revival method. So they apply it through submersion. Yeah. They first drain the lungs and then... That's actually kind of interesting. As weird as that sounds to me to say, I know, but still. <laughs> no! No, sir, I don't like it. There was a door here. Insert the suppository. Oh, I'm back here. Okay. We'll go upstairs. Ding. Where did the results come out? Dang.
Bed tubes go. Oh. There's just a tube here. <laughs> okay. Getting the rings. Down here, Daddy. Faster, faster. Oh, wonderful. Again, with the minor massive internal bleeding. There's another note. Are you muted again? Yes. Oh geez, I have to zoom in on this. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scalded. Dehaired and scraped and ready for the f game broiling? Is that game broiling or game broiling? Rolling, I think. Game broiling and evisceration. For this, we need to pass them through the steam reservoir, which is kept at a constant temperature by passing excess high pressure venting from the engine via the boiler and series of large copper pipes into a stone chamber just below the workhouse. At the center of the machine, there's a component that must be kept at a consistently low temperature, which controls operations of processing of product throughout the system. Alongside this, refrigeration is of the utmost importance in retaining product quality. And this also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution. The removal of heat from the same areas and the requirement for increased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principles of convection regulated by the boiler and sending freezing air along one set of pipes in one direction and superheated vapors in yet another. Oh. oh. Isn't this... it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? 
We can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excreta flooding through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. Dear God, the stench! This fecal matter is the true product of the age. <laughs> <laughs> Great. It's the invisibles. Loose gate one. Well, like sledge gate. Something tells me I'm gonna have to go in there. Kevin, it's just a bath and pig, human, and who knows what else. Who? We fine. Why is there an office down here? Well, if you look at it, it looks more makeshift than anything else. But it also makes sense that there'd be someone down here to uh, monitor the flow and all the time, everything, if you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Okay, so this is telling me where I am. Uh-huh. Turn off the light. Okay. I was just trying to see exactly where you were. Your lantern was making that difficult to determine. Yeah. There's another note on the table. Your turn. I have a headache. Okay. Several of the older forms have breached their containment area and escaped into the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no... Kelm? I'm no... Ilahu? I, I don't know what that means. At least not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway between... The doorway between open that is to blame. Okay. We cannot simply pack them about with coolant as we do the center where the doorway is. The latter versions are kept safe by the freezing temperature 
of those towers up here where the air is hot and fetid. They become overheated and their daily their duality tears them asunder. As the other places as the other place flies from their cells and their vitae splinters they live sporadically torn from one world to the other and back again in violent unpredictable bursts for a few seconds they are creatures of this world then they are torn away and cease to have physical form this vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected areas sealed and will not allow my local worker loyal workers to enter. They these are doomed places now. The Abbey Dicks what was that? Uh, you got a follower. That's what wow. that was. <laughs> wow! Cool. Yeah, that I, scared me too. I, I can't pronounce your name, but thank you for the uh, follow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Egan Ch Chikazi something? <laughs> I, Wow, that that shocked me. I was just like, <laughs> that's the first, the first follow. The... Cool. Thank you so much. Unusual noises. <laughs> that was it. Like right in the middle of reading. Blink. Ah. <laughs> They're coming for you. <laughs> Well, and the thing is, like, it's it's a uh, it's a relatively cute sound in a horror game, and I'm just like, what is going on? <laughs> oh, just call him Lycan. Lycan. Oh, okay, Lycan. So, uh, Colin, introduce yourself to our new friend. I'm the voice in his head. Oh, great. Thanks. That helps a lot. Yes, I know. Is it just me, or is it producing more walls? I can only hear the sludge moving, so I don't know. Oh, yeah, Kevin, the wall behind you wasn't there before. That's where you came in from. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought. It's a more walls. <laughs> we are here to watch you shit your pants in horror from this game. <laughs> <laughs> well, why, while I don't have that particular internal problem... Ew... Did I just hear one of the things in there fart? No, it growled. Oh, I thought a fart. Oh, I see what you're saying, ew, at. Yeah. Now, whoever made those, that's impressive and their ass must hurt. I, I just recall that uh, those were Markiplier's worst fear in the Amnesia games. It's just like, sorry, water and horror are just my kryptonite. <laughs> uh... Did I hear a regular pig? Would you stop calling me that? I told you I have an eating problem. 
No, you don't. You've never told me that. <laughs> <laughs> One second, Grumbly. There's a oh, great. another wax cylinder down here. But we can Why? We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Landis, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? <laughs> and your engineer, this visionary with whom you have embarked upon this course, does he share your views? Indeed he does. Indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, this is not the first great civilization he has wept for. And so you set about things immediately upon your return. Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. Again, the analogies. Get pigs in his brain. Yeah, what? I like how he says he's going to make this world clean and look where this wax cylinder is located. I, I know, that's why I laughed. There's a gate. That helps. Oh. There's another note on the shelf. Oh, no. You read. Is it too disturbing to read for you again? This is sad. Do you want me to read it? Because you're too emotional? No, no, no. I'll, I'll, I'll read this one. And I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, we can, we can see it. A tall, weathered cap of steep of a steep sided pyramid so like those of Egypt stone falling away from the summit vines crawling about intertwining the stucco serpents that thrive about the steps a palpable sense of stillness a weight of forgotten And this here, this is where the kings, the king sat, and this is where the priests lived, this house. This is the house of the dead, and here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they most certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether, or perhaps their tragedy was they could simply not spill enough blood to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. 
Aztecs. How was that sad? Aztecs or Mayans? I can't remember. How was that sad? I thought this was the note about the, uh... Well, about what he did. Pedophilia got ya. No! He killed them. Well, considering the fact that in the very beginning we saw them come through a brick wall, that was always on my mind. That he killed them. Yes. I really need to stop playing with my grenade. That's it, Helper. You're so near now. <laughs> Lycan says, it's coming for you. Oh, gosh. Oh, I, can't, I, can't, I can never remember the order of this thing. Come on. Left, center, right. After turning it on. No, it's... Turn it on... Yeah, yeah it's turn it on, left, center... Pressure. Or... Okay, this place does need an airlock. Just because of what you came out of, you need it. Yeah, really. Wait, are you... Are you telling me he drained this part of the sewers? And cleaned yep. it? That's impressive. <laughs> My next... Why is there a record player down here? That's what he said a while ago, is that they they would soothe them with the music. Which is fine, because this music is actually okay. It's the one that was playing at the time was awful. Oh, gross. Yes. Yes, you did tell him it was coming for him. What's coming? Are you talking to Lycan? Yes. What did he say? I, I just told you what he said. What's coming? He's just saying it's coming for you. I'm just relaying the message. You know, I can see why the pigs are relaxed by this music. Although I still prefer Sabaton. <laughs> Sabaton. Can you imagine? Just somebody put Sabaton in here and all the pigs just go to sleep. <laughs> then again, I've done that before. I've even done it to uh, World War One Artillery Barrage. Oh, it is coming. I think he means the clown. Oh, because we're in the sewer. Got it. I did not make that connection because I still have not seen that movie. Oh, poor guy. That 
That was just funny. Floating to the ladder. I'm in a tube. When an entire building has gas, how do you fix that? You drill a hole in it. Or you give it a laxative. I'm saving those movies for a special occasion, like an... Ow. Movies? Yeah. It. <laughs> His answer to, um, uh, clearing the, tu the uh, building filled with gas? Light a match. Oh, gosh. <laughs> It'd be yeah, like I'm the. Just imagining him. Uh, it'd be like the end of Waterworld, where they uh, light up the uh, the tanker. Oh yeah. What I'm what I'm imagining though is the building doesn't explode. It just zooms out, and you just see that like an office building, and you just see a flash of light through the entire building. Just oh, the end. Okay, was this place built on a fault line? No, it was built in London. I don't recall London ever having earthquakes. There was an earthquake in Florida a while ago. The most eventful earthquake I've heard about was actually like in the middle of the US. It was geysers of sand popping out of the ground. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's that. There, there was something event. I can't remember what it was called. There's two places that I want to avoid being near. It's that place and Yosemite. Ah, uh, well, if Yosemite goes off, we're screwed. The Florida earthquake I was talking about was caused by a military naval explosive test off the coast. Apparently, it blew up bigger than they anticipated. Smooth. Yeah, the atomic bomb wasn't supposed to blow up as big as it did. It also wasn't supposed to irradiate the people watching. Well, no. You seem to have undergone quite a profound conversion in Mexico, Mr. Mangan. You could not have seen it yourself and not, Professor. As we disembarked, even through my fever, I saw the detritus of this so-called progress. 
I saw starvation and disease, rot and destruction polluting the waters of the Empire. We are ruiners, you and I, and all of us, and we make the world unclean. And you took it upon yourself to act as Redeemer. <laughs> Professor, I would not be so presumptuous. I am merely a conduit. I am constructing an architecture to wrestle our damnation to the ground and smother it with steam. And a pillow. Ahead, the trickle to still waters. I drag myself deeper into the temple, downward ever, towards a wind that felt the voices of my children, beckoning me to set them free. Weird. I don't understand the whole angelic choir about that, but okay. Oh, look, blood! Mm. Wait, there's poop on one side and blood on the other? The heck was that about? You're gonna hear some strumming in a second while I'm on the ladder. Something's gonna flash in front of me, and I'm not sure what it is. I, I don't know. Sure, well, all wheels are in place for correct operation. All wheels. That's a really stupid door. Really loud room. The water ones are an inconvenience. The regular ones are in the way. The only one I'm actually worried about... Ah. 
The only one I'm really worried about is the Tesla one. Your pants are covered in puke. Oh. Lichen says, zappy zappy, gonna get zapped in the butt. I should hope not. But yes, they are strangely electrical. I couldn't tell with the name Tesla, but... No, I mean like the... the even the water ones are very zappy. That sounds like that that piston is broken. Sounds like a lot of things in here are broken. Ow. What am I supposed to throw it at? Through the light. Clink. That one looks like a rock. Oh. So falling down there was completely useless. Hmm. Maybe, maybe not. Let me check this note. Nice. <laughs> Read it. No. Fine. The flood is drained. I have prevailed. The saboteur is beaten. My heart pounds with excitement, even as my head spins and shudders in fervorous anticipation. How this machine throbs about me, sensing its rebirth imminent. The final descent beckoned me, beckons me to enter. As early once lay on our wedding bed and summoned me into man nice <laughs> nice I have no comment <laughs> just 
Nice. I've been trying to figure out what lichens meant by oh yes earlier. You just went oh yes and I and I don't I I don't know. Probably at a point when I said oh no or something. Oh uh, yeah yeah that that sounds like him. We've known you for about a half hour, and we already know your, uh... Colloquialisms, or whatever the word is? Colloquialisms? Whatever the word is, isms. Pressure? systems access. Ooh. We're getting there. Ew. Uh. <laughs> okay. Sorry. I reacted to that because I I didn't feel that coming. It just happened. <laughs> With how big mine get, a as you know, <laughs> mine, I don't know when they come, but when they do know they come, it hurts. Oh god. I I'm hearing myself on playback and I sound like a complete moron sometimes. <laughs> I honestly thought that this was going to get uh, more refined as we got deeper. It's actually getting less. Sexually? What? Oh, I mean in I construction. Structurally. Oh, structurally. Okay, structurally and sexually sound a lot alike. Ugh. No unauthorized persons to enter this facility by order of the management. Why is it that they add the to things that don't need it, and they remove the from things that do need it? Like, they say, I'm going to hospital. I do not have sex on the mind, Lycan, thank you. He has many things on the mind. That is the least worrying. <laughs> well... Well, if you'll give me a moment, I am going to go get some pie. Ah. For your children, Magnus, to spare them the world you have created for us all. And I'm sorry, Lycan, if you've been uh, typing things and I haven't been able to respond to you directly in time, because I don't have it set up where I can see the, uh, 
comments. That's why he's here helping me out with that. I needed another monitor off to the side for that. Would help. I've just got this really big one right in front of me. So if you are also responding to what I just said, I won't be able to tell what you're saying until he, he gets back. I do love the voice acting in this game, I will say that. And they feel no pain. The process is completely humane. Humane, Professor. That we judge the acceptable level of suffering by the human condition. Ask the beggar, Professor. Ask the orphan. Ask the whore. Ask the starving, Professor. The weak, the sick, the filthy. Ask them to define your humane. I mean, you know, he's a terrible monster that tortures people and turns them into pigs, but... Got a point. <laughs> Oh, great. I gotta figure out these switches. Probably shouldn't have done that. And I can't undo it. Great. Are you having fun? Did you see what um, uh, Lycan just said, or no? No, I, I I told him that I can't see what he says, so please, enlighten me. Uh, he says, uh, I, it's okay, I understand, and I don't mind. Could just ask for steam handle, and I'll just poke you on it. He don't have steam, I don't think. Oh! Steam handle. Yeah, I tend not to give that stuff out. Why is number three not working? I don't know, but I love that noise. That weird alarm? Yeah. I've always been a fan of Auga. <laughs> I tried I'm eating a whole turkey. I tried tyrant. so hard. I will uphold my promise. I will always protect them for you. My eyes are your eyes. My heart is your heart. I will rip them loose from this rotten world and set them to burn. All to save them. <laughs> what? Like, oh. Oh, by the way, I don't think he's actually eating a whole pie. I think it's one of those hand-sized ones. Yes, yes it is. But, um, he says... 
<laughs> maybe it's an, so, just the way he said it made me giggle. Maybe it's an issue with something in the machini. The machini? In the machini. He's like broken? Clogged? I would not be surprised if something in this thing was clogged. Yeah. But still, I'm just going to say I love the way he put that. It it just tickles me. <laughs> hmm. Danger. Compound X. Highly flammable. Highly corrosive. Highly toxic. Highly great. Lycan, are you calling me fat? Oh, that's what was wrong. The lid was on. <laughs> oh, machinery. <laughs> just reminds me of the, the old Bill Cosby episode, uh, not epi uh, commercial, uh, when they started putting flip-top lids on, uh, toothpaste. Got a flip-top lid! There we are. I don't know what that did, but there we are. I'm watching. I'm watching you. <laughs> quickly, quickly, the air is thin. The little faces turn more madness. They suffocate. They suffocate. Inception. I live. I breathe again. Uh, Kevin, where the red and green lever are right now, it looks like a uh, a Tie Fighter window. And set the future upon the path to redemption. Where are my children? You promised me my children. My time is come, more pig, more pig. Boys, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. With how industrious this guy was, can you imagine how awesome it would have been if he had actually done something good? <laughs> and emerging i raised my head to an uncaring sun that would be and i nice. cursed this world but you did you see what i mean though by the thing from before this the tie fighter window this civilization built on the ricketed bones of the unfortunate on the greed and swell of mammon and empire cradling a stone egg in my jacket i kissed my children farewell and i crawled my way home Yeah, I, I love those style windows. I 
I don't think he... Is he carrying a kidney stone in his pocket? Also, uh, he and I played Mass Effect together into the ground. He's uh, suggesting we should play Mass Effect or Final Fantasy. Oh, yeah, we did play Mass Effect into the ground. We went all out, like, through all three of them. Did we go through all three of them while I was at your house? Yes, yes, we did. Yeah. Whole hog into the, uh, the tally storyline. Dick deep into a squealing <laughs> pain! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> Can a man construct himself anew? Can a man... On realizing who he is, on what he has become, tear himself apart down to the bricks and begin again. Are our so yes, it's called Christianity. Anyway, are you our souls just this tiny cog wheels and clockwork and intricate machines to serve a function that, on reflection, we might set to a new task? Can a man, defined by his actions, defined by what? Uh, that which he now finds abhorrent, set to sabotage this body, his machine, until those children of his soul turn in new motion. And he may awaken to a new sun, a new year, a new century, with hope in his heart. As I reach my hands to the exposed wires, I ask myself this, is redemption possible? For such a creature as I, and if not, then surely better to die amongst my creations than to continue to live as a monster. Okay, so he tried to electrocute himself. Nice. That must have been a shocking experience. Pressure regulation. All right, Lycan, so you know, he would probably be the one to go after Tally because of that butt. <laughs> I, on the other hand, don't know. I would probably also go Tally just because I love her personality. Honestly, like, that that was more endearing because she's just adorable. Especially with the fluid induction port. Tally, that's a straw. <laughs> oh no. He made the kids work in the factory to clean the hard to reach places. Well, that's what people do during that time. I know. Child labor is a thing. But they of were. Of course, you would induce Garrus. What did he say? Uh, he says Garrus is the best. Lol. Well, yeah, Garrus is. Like, well, yeah, you go through the full story, and Garrus is like Shepard's best friend through the whole thing. I just think, uh, like it wants some bird dick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> First, you can hold the pressure, pressure down for a short period so that they must be fast or they risk being trapped and boiled by the superheated vapors. And they rush back into the system. And we will be sending their comrades in wow. afterwards to. Scrape free the cooling mess. Ah, oh, gross. Kinky. Oh. Oh, come on. What? Read the read the last sentence. The survivors tell me you can reach all manner of places with the complex through the pipes. 
I smile, tell them I am so proud, and feed them to the pigs. Okay. That's what was all over that table. Okay, so that's all green. This entire room is a sauna. Okay, this is all green. How do I turn it off? How about I create a regulator shut up? I need to break the glass. Okay, so, okay, Lycan decided to clear up the air and why he go for bird dick. Okay. Uh, he says, if female, he touches nobody till Mass Effect 2, and then he'd go after the bird dick. Okay. Otherwise, he wants to go for squid ass or tally ass. <laughs> do you really have to say it like that? Yes, I do. <laughs> Cleansing fire always And when I say tally ass, I but technically don't know what species she is. I almost have a feeling she's a lizard of some sort. The fevered flesh. Did it hurt to cut free the gangrenous foot? Ask instead this. Maybe. Can we save them? When did I say that? That is not me. That is not me. Can I, can I unwoo? I'm all woozy. Can't see anything. He just said biotics will always win against engineers, and I, I agree with that until the third and Andromeda. In that case, Andromeda does not exist. No, I enjoyed Andromeda, thank you. I just don't like the people behind it. Did that pig leave me a note? Maybe. But, um... I think uh, the soldier would win wins out against Biotics for one reason and one reason alone. What's that? Guns! <laughs> Glorious guns! <laughs> oh, wait a second, no. Mass Effect 1 and 2, only the soldier could use all the weapons. In 3 and the past, they can we every class can use every weapon, so I'm backwards. Oh, okay. Maybe, I think. I don't remember. Gross. That is true, uh, Lycan, uh, the singularity ability for, uh, biotics are really powerful. It's just for me, I like the, uh... 
sorry, the bell ringing in my ear hurt. The Swiss Army status of the the soldiers with the multiple different ammo types, grenades, all that type of stuff. It's it's more of an all around class rather than one thing or another. Does that make any sense? And then the need to break it open. Kevin, the facility's diving. Diving? Yes. The uh, Awuga siren is the same siren on the World War II submarine. And it's going off in the exact same pattern, too. Yeah. I don't know where to go. Huh. That way. Bolts are shearing and that. hitting me. Ow! This is your doom, Mandus. This is what you trained it to be. I will stop you. I will save them. Did you? Did you just get shot by a steam-powered Reddit? Yes. Kill them, my peas! Kill them all! But, um, Lycan, I have to agree with you completely there. They're more useful in certain situations, but where the soldier picks up for that is with its with their weaponry. Would you agree with that, Kevin? Colin, I think I think you you two might be having this argument under different pretexts. What you're talking about is gameplay mechanics. I think he's talking about in the world. Uh, no, I think it's talking about gameplay mechanics. Because it does, uh, it says, a Singularity into push equals biotic explosion o death. It does yeah. make sense, but depending on the game, biotic slash engineering are more useful. I think, e even with all the hand waving about the, the way that the physics works with the z z element zero and that weirdness. Mm -hmm. I think the only thing I disagreed with any of the writers on was the entire idea of biotics. It just seemed like an excuse to make space magic. Well, it didn't make the game more interesting. Done. 
and the combat drone with missiles. That's interesting, but it's still limited of use. It's kind of eh for me. I prefer the drone with flamethrower. This is not what I meant. This is not what and yeah, I meant space magic all. is fun. Like it. Is that a naked guy in the street? Yeah. Go touch his dick. No. <laughs> Poke him there, see if he's awake. <laughs> this isn't Amnesia 1. Oh gosh. It, it, I mean, it's so strange. Like, the conversation he had with that professor, he uh, chides him for asking if the process is humane and talking about how all these people are suffering. But on the other hand, he's literally just killing the poor and not caring about it. Like communism! <laughs> yeah, no, no one misses the pole. Round up some orphans, and the world will thank you for it. Disappear a whore, and a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar, and a lady walks safely. I can't read anymore. Redeem yourself! Redemption is at hand. Enter the cleansing and set your souls free. For you are born in the I will die in the I would just call that no, German. World War II German. Ascend to the skies and claim the heavens as your kingdom. Fall on your knees. Ashes, ashes, bones and ashes. For the pile will reach critical and we can have such a burning. dead. She's very dead. Oh, a note. It's convenient that these notes are just outside during the Great London Fire. <laughs> I just looked it up, you were right. On April 5th, 1899, there was a fire in London that originated in a factory. Nice. Yeah, I found the original newspaper article on it, so. I just gotta figure out where to go. It looked like you could actually climb in through uh, one of those. Uh, oh, never mind, you found it. Yeah. Do you hear me, man? 
Angus. This is what you plan. Oh, uh, my puppy's being a real pistol. He likes to chew everybody's fingers. He's drawn blood from my dad twice. What, did you just hear him bite him or something? Nah, he just does it. Or he has. My dad was in a happy camper for a few moments, but the face, he couldn't resist the face, so he just walked out of the room. Don't you dare be dissing my puppy, Lycan. It's brand new. Nine weeks. And it's that long. <laughs> He's tried jumping over my legs several times and he actually ended up... Uh, going ass first over <laughs> my leg. Just woo! Yeah, he's a little, little wiener dog. Still haven't come up with a name. We've been arguing. We want to name him something German. Pro I do agree they're like and uh, German Shepherds, Malmutes, Huskies, and Wolf Dogs are very good breeds. The problem is, A, they shed a lot, B, they're not hypoallergenic. Yeah, if he had a regular dog, his head would explode. He takes the Jeff Dunham skit a little too well to heart. He just said, note to self, poor hobo never getting normal breeds, always those small little punchables. Is this someone you know? Mayhaps. Interesting.
if light makes electricity Now, if that was real technology, whoever would invent that would be a billionaire in a few days. Well, uh, I was just thinking about it. Doesn't that look like a solar panel? Well, I... Will they be free? It's that kind of yes, dark blue. my friend. Drained and bled and freed from the prison of the flesh. No. To ascend a smoke to One, stars. it's too and square. Go. Two. How will we save them? Show me these worthy matters. Uh, solar Show panels do not work good. with just a, a spotlight. Not no, no, that's not what I mean. The, the, the stuff in the tank looks like what they coat um, solar panels with. Hmm. Oh, great. The tripery. What is the tripery? I don't remember. Tripery. Tripe, sorry. Yeah, it's what uh, is that? I... it's it's the meat processing factory. Ooh. Oh, okay. To bed, to bed, to toss and turn on both stomachs. Yeah, like and understood exactly what you were saying, even though I didn't right away. Uh, it's a part of the creation so that the solar panels trap the light and use it as energy. Yeah. Yeah. But imagine just a... Uh, just a vat of that stuff. <laughs> Three walls of steel bars dropping from the ceiling. A camera indicates the product of the bed, preventing escape. The it's then tilted backwards. The system is created as a byproduct of the vacuum. Bottled revolution. The movement of the masses is a causal factor. He is a communist. <laughs> he literally wants to eat the rich. Interesting. Okay, so danger compound X. Oh, this is compound X. Oh no. This amount this would blow the entire place up. Oh no. It's 
sledding. Oh, it just electrified the water. <laughs> Colin, get out of there. There's a pig in your room. <laughs> I'm sorry. It worked. Good. Now. I just heard it, and that sounded horrifyingly gross. Yeah. That's what you have to deal with all the time? I'm sorry. I am not fat, Lycan. I am not a pig. I only ate meat in a box once. Twice. Fine, twice. <laughs> the second time was on stream. I know you, machine. I know what you fear. I will rain excrement into your very soul. I will destroy you. You are too low, Commanders. My great works are almost begun. Do you think that's actually a good point? Lycan says I did sound like one of the pig creatures from the burp, but maybe I should actually hire myself out for the burp and manipulate it so I just sound like some horror monster. See if I get money that way. <laughs> just record a sound and copyright it. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, there are three sounds that are copyrighted in existence. Yeah, the, the Harley, Harley. Um, I can't remember the other two. Still missed. Boxes are already in this. 
damp this falling water, I hack and retch and vomit into the sink and grasp the bowl with my hands in the air. Thursday, a toy spine? Child's spine. Clockwork, how could that be? What? Weird. There he is, yelling more pig again. I want to look up the voice actor when this is over. <laughs> I am here again, at the foot of those stairs. Towards the red light of the nursery. Sunset in the window like a bleeding sky. The horizon a slit throat. The seeping dark to drain the guilt from us. I am the jaguar-faced man. I am the feathered serpent. This priesthood is mine. Uh, I see a ghost. Uh oh, I think we lost God. Second, let, let me check on that. What happened? Hello? Sorry, computer. Your computer what? Did it die? Yeah, my computer's power went out. Ah. And uh, it may happen again in a few seconds. Just a heads up. Okay. Did you stop playing just so I could get back? Well, yeah. I mean, you're you're my co-host. I can't not play without you. I am not a host. I'm a, I'm the voice in your head. Get it right. Do you want to see the pig in the office? What is that pig doing? Eating. You know? Don't lie, that does sound like me at the dinner. How marvelous. I must say, Mr. Manders, my excitement is almost unseemly. Yes, I got it. Sorry for all the uh, sounds. Way, I just heard I will there. Right I have to do it. Manders. Manders, where the devil are you? I can't see a damn thing. Manders! We are the pig, Professor. We are all the pig. Hmm. It's never healthy to be obsessed with pigs. Pork is good, yes, but... 
When you make something like the McRib, you need to really change your priorities. Yeah. Especially if you bring it back twice. I climb in stillness now. Blue water runs. How many times has the McRib been back? I carry Actually, the knife it might have been back factory, three times. The bowl of this mill. I am come to collect you from your fields and your furnaces. Three? I will gather you into the white clouds. I will gather you to me. And I will take you home. The thing is, the first one was good, It, but every time they bring it back, it's not as good as the first one. Or at least that's what I keep hearing. But this is uh, not water, by the way. That surprises you? No. Oh, good. What surprises me that it, is that it's still liquid. Would you rather be solid or gelatinous? No, after like. a day, it should not be liquid anymore. <laughs> Especially in the heat. This could be one of the colder rooms he was talking about, though. Uh, Lycan says it keeps coming back because I keep changing the recipe. But it's still always made out of the worst parts of the pig. Hear me, Mandus. My gears are like toenails. My steam is built. Soon I will spill that blue water and split the egg, the atom, my soul, and there will be a very great burning that we might make the world clean. Be proud, for this is your doing. Until you steeped me in the blood of your own, I was nothing but rotten architecture. You have made me, and I will make the world anew. I have a question. Who hmm. is this dude's engineer? I I think he's from a different world. He's like from Amnesia Rebirth. He's from that other plane of existence. Oh, okay. No, all right, no, all, all, all I owe. Small pile of stones. I've already read this. Range? I, I have no idea how close I am to the end. I think you're close. Vacuum eviscerators? Oh, gross. So wait, that just sucks the intestines out? I guess. Oh, lovely. But why did you take my children? I, Mandus. Put the suction cup on the anus and turn the machine on. Together. The first drops fell from your hands alone. Then I am damned for a filicide. And everything is lost. Have you noticed in every game where you get amnesia, you end up being a total asshole or have some sort of really bad mental disability, and when you get amnesia, it's gone? Well, yeah, because whatever sets of memories you had up to that point brought you to those decisions.
In my mind, it just feels like a reset button with the way they're doing it in this game. Or in games in general. It's like, you're an asshole? Quick, push this button. You're not an asshole anymore. Live right. Who are you? No, Good. but Go. here, here's the thing. Is that... You, you look through those games and the same sets of things set themselves up. And you end up like that again anyway. Some... Not all the time. Well, yeah, but it's just like, that's what they try to do in a lot of these games, is they try to do that thing where they gave you a false sense of choice. Where it's like, all the, all the options are bad. Like in, uh, in Soma, uh, uh. The, like, it, everything you do is basically pointless in that game really sad. Still a good game, though. Oh yeah, it's a fantastic game. Oh, gosh. Okay, here's the thing. I have no idea how to deal with this thing. None. Carefully. Uh, no, this is a, a panic and run situation, and I don't know how to deal with it. That red glowy be dead. Ow. Ah. <sighs> I I need to take a break anyway. We we have dinner ready. All right. Well, I guess that's it then. Eight thirty. I was. That's actually pretty solid. Yeah, for you, it's 10.30 for me. Yeah. Joik. <laughs> That's three, three and a half hours. Yep. I think what I might do... Uh... When I when I post this to YouTube, I'll the, it has an option to cut it up into fifteen minute segments. So I think I might do that. Okay. Yeah, that would be the best bet. Yeah. More videos that way. Well, thanks for sticking around, Lycan. It's uh, been very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yes, especially with bird dick and squid ass. <laughs> and thank you for uh, being my my first follower outside of Colin. But you know, it doesn't really count. He's part of the production. Like one of the Final Fantasies. I don't have any of the Final Fantasies. I do. And Colin and I can play with you. Ah. Uh... Play with. I I don't know which Final Fantasy you're talking about. Like uh, I think it's talking about Final Fantasy 15 online. It's a thing now. Is it? Yeah. Uh. Is it? Or is that 14? How, how did, did they change the combat system? Is it like basically real time now? What what's this? Uh. The way Final Fantasy works now is you're a single character. It's real time slash. Uh, like, it's almost like real time slash Pokemon at the same time, I guess you could say. So it's like real time with cooldowns? No, 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 no. I, I Well, I don't know.
I guess you'll have to look that up. And apparently Lycan has every single one of them. Yeah, I, I can read them now. I don't have the game up. I've, I've just got the stream here. Uh, I don't know. I'll I'll do a little research on it and and I'll see, but uh, I can't say when that would be because right now I'm just trying to get through Amnesia. <laughs> and uh, I think the next stream. Well, I don't know. Oh yeah, he he said yeah, real time with cooldowns. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Like, that's easier to deal with. Yeah, if you can tell, I am not well versed in Final Fantasy. Yeah. Um, he said I could library share. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, do you remember what we used to do with Xbox, where I would, uh, we would claim each other's Xbox as each other's home or something like that? Oh, okay. Ba yeah, it's basically that ordeal. Huh. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, I'll, I'll look into it, but yeah, like I said, I'll, uh, I'm just trying to get through Amnesia right now. Uh, I don't know when the next stream is going to be, because I was planning on just doing these ones for Tuesdays and Thursdays. You want to do them on the days I have class. Well, they're also the days when I have some free space. <laughs> oh, okay. Because mom and dad are usually go to work then, so I can be louder. <laughs> okay. And also, uh, like in there is a difference between master and nerd. <laughs> That is also true. All right, I'm going to end the stream. All right. Then I shall talk to y'all later. Bye-bye. Blah.